The first step after receiving your access data is to log in to your BTU account and make any necessary changes, such as changing your password. You should also check your BTO email account via webmail to make sure that you do not miss any important emails. I'll be happy to show you exactly how to do this. To get to the BTU account, simply go to the BTU homepage. Simply click on the tab Study, For Studies, IT and Media Services and then click on the blue marked link BTU account. Alternatively, you can type b-tu.de slash account directly into your browser. Then you will get to the login. Here you log in with your personal data. First, you have to enter your username. This usually consists of the first five letters of your last name and the first three letters of your first name. However, there are also other usernames. For example, if your last name has less than five letters, if an account with the same username already exists or similar, then consecutive numbers will be added. You'll get your username during the registration process. You can think of your own password. The best thing to do is to choose something you can remember well, as you will need it more often during your studies. Then click on Login. The BTU account is used to manage your password. For example, you can change it here at any time. For security reasons, the password to the BTU account must be changed once a year. You will receive a reminder via your BTU email address in good time, two weeks in advance. Once the password has expired, it can only be reset using the computer center. So keep your eyes open for the reminder emails and change your password in time. More information can be found on the BTU homepage under IT Services BTU account. You will receive a short note regarding your password so that it is as secure as possible. The password must be 7 or 8 characters long and must contain at least one special character. In the following, you will enter your old password as well as your new password. Then you confirm everything with a click on Change Password, which is Password Enden in German. If you rarely use your BTU webmail or if two email inboxes are too cumbersome for you, you can have all important emails concerning your studies forwarded to an email address of your choice. This way you will always know what's going on and can't miss out on important emails. To do this, enter the email address in the destination address field or Zieladresse in German and then click on Activate, Aktivieren. If you activate the field Backup Local Copy to BTU Server or Lokale Kopie auf dem BTU Server sichern in German, you must remember to empty your BTU mailbox regularly so that you have enough storage space to continue receiving new emails. If you don't check this box, you won't have to worry about storage space. Please use this feature as it is extremely important to check your emails regularly. You will receive important notifications from the administration or other portals via your BTU email address. You can also get to the webmail via the BTU homepage. Simply click on the tab Study, For Studies, IT and Media Services and then on the blue marked link Webmail. Alternatively, you can also enter b-du.de slash webmail directly into your browser. If you are already logged in, you will automatically be redirected to webmail. Otherwise, you will also have to log in here with your personal BTU account data. Once you have successfully registered, this interface will appear, your BTU webmail box. Here you get all the important messages you need for your studies. This could be emails or notifications, from fellow students, lecturers, the library or the student service. Messages that are sent from the Moodle BTU learning platform are also received here. If you would like to send an email yourself, click on mail in the bar at the top and then on new message, Neue Nachricht in German. The following window will then open. First, enter the recipient of your message in the first field. Then choose this subject. Under Add Attachments or Anhang hinzufügen in German, you have the possibility to send documents together with the email. In the field below, 
you write your message, which you can then send by clicking on the button in the upper left corner. If you want your send mails to be saved, you have to check the box Save in Send. Speichern in Gesend in German. As an example, your mailbox can look like this. You will receive emails from Prüfungsverwaltung at b-tu.de in the form of a confirmation of your examination registration if you have successfully registered for an examination. Emails from Bibliothek plus Ausleihe from the library if, for example, your long period for borrowed medium like a book ends. You can select as many messages as you like by marking the checkbox. By clicking on the delete button, you can delete all marked emails or move them to the trash. To reply a received email, simply click on the reply button. To forward an email to another person, you can use the forward function. When you have checked all your emails, you can log out of your inbox by clicking the orange button in the top right corner. In order to complete your logout, you must finally click on the here button or here in German. Now you are successfully logged out and can also close your browser.